The rapid rise of drone delivery service is becoming more competitive by the day, and Zipline is crushing the competition, being the world's largest drone delivery service on the market. The website shows the current areas of operation, in that the company already has over 80 million miles flown, over 1.1 million deliveries made, and over 11 million items delivered with as little as a one minute delivery window, with a delivery speed about seven times faster than an average car delivery, and zero carbon emissions. There is already a wide list of items you can order, ranging from restaurant deliveries, groceries, to medication and more. For instance, in April 2019 in Ghana, Zipline began using drones to deliver vaccines, blood, and medicine more efficiently. During the COVID-19 pandemic in 2020, the U.S. Federal Aviation Administration granted a Part 107 aviation waiver to Zipline's partner organization, Novent Health, for the delivery of medical supplies and personal protective equipment to medical facilities in North Carolina. And as of September 2021, more than 75% of blood deliveries in Rwanda outside of Kigali used Zipline drones. The country has announced an expanded partnership to serve the entire country to make nearly 2 million deliveries and fly more than 200 million kilometers in Rwanda by 2029, making a huge step forward for the drone delivery sector. This drone cruises at 101 kilometers or 63 miles per hour at an altitude of 80 to 120 meters, which is around 260 to 390 feet above ground level, which ensures that deliveries are made within an impressive 45 minutes. It can carry 1.8 kilograms or four pounds in supplies and fly 300 kilometers on a charge, though they limit themselves to destinations of a maximum 80 kilometers. It has a wingspan of 11 feet and weighs 20 kilograms with a replaceable battery that's easy and quick to swap out and charge. A steel rail by an electric motor launches the drone to an acceleration of 108 kilometers an hour in just 0.3 seconds. And although they have two, they're built to fly safely on a single propeller. If any problems occur during flight, a parachute can be deployed to bring the drone safely to the ground. They are capable of level 4 autonomy, meaning they have the ability to travel autonomously under safe environmental conditions without needing any pilot supervision. With the continuing rise of technology and expansion we're seeing with not only Zipline, but with the drone delivery sector in general, there's no doubt that we'll be seeing this spreading globally at a significant scale in the upcoming years. Do you think this is a good or a bad thing for our future? And are you concerned with increased air pollution? Let me know in the comments section below. And to stay up to date with future content, hit that like and subscribe button. Thank you all for watching and until next time, save that money.